redox signaling molecule is an uttermost for me alignment with that because it reminds us that we are the medicine. By fueling ourselves with our own inner resonance, by fueling ourselves with our own inner frequency, we're giving the, our body the time and space to remember, to remember to heal itself. <laughs> So I'm really excited to actually deliver this video for you uh, because I'm really passionate about the subject. And so this video is specifically for you if health is one of your top values, but you're also someone on the conscious path and you understand the importance of taking care of your vessel, of repairing, of clearing your body, your physical body, supporting it to be able to embody your consciousness, to be able to embody higher states of awareness and consciousness. And in that way, you allow your light body to come through in a much more easy and graceful way. Because you actually understand that everything is codes. So your body is kind of, you see it, the kind of that computer operating system and inside it, what is really the DNA, what is really the cellular um, structure is actually codes. It's all coding. It's all frequencies, all vibration. So you actually understand that whatever you put into your body is also whatever those codes actually are, are either in support and synergy with your own frequency, with your own codes of your body. So they're going to allow it to elevate. They're going to allow more light to come through, or it's actually going to get it to be more dense it's going to allow it to be more like short circuit um, and then in that way the codes are actually not in alignment with your own original blueprint so to give a little bit of background is that i've been in the field of health for the last decade and i've owned an organic health store where i supplied the best of the best and high quality products so i have a lot of research into that whole health reality and health field and always looked for and reached towards the highest um, highest quality of all products to an extent even that organic store had a, na a name that expressed light because it was all its purpose was really to support the light body with light products and to be able to embody more of our consciousness by through that and so I've been in that field and I have a huge range of experience and experimenting with myself and everything that I ever sold or had for to offer to other people was never something that I have not tried myself and has I, I did not feel frequently that it actually worked for me. Now the thing is I also I am aware that there's just so much out there right now. We are literally in a bombardment of information and there's so many people out there, so many influencers or so many people that are just sending those things like oh here's that product and here's that product and here's that product. and that can get very overwhelming. But I'm going to share with you because my hope for this video is that it might be the calling for you like the call, like how it was the calling for me. Because going back in time, I was in a very strong um, communion with spirit for three nights. There was this very, and I've never experienced that coding actually in the way that I did, of when you really have that visceral full body calling for something. Not just like you're wishing something, but really your entire body is calling for it like you just know you're ready for it you know that it's there and you're calling for it and it was this very intense strong three night journey where I was in communion with spirit and I got I really felt deep down that I knew deep down that there was something out there that existed that was what I needed what I've been calling for to upgrade my health but also to support the health of my family I just knew it was there and it was beyond like vitamins and supplements and, you know, taking those things to detox the organs and all of that, but also beyond those technologies as, as well, frequency technologies or frequency machines. Like I just knew that there was something there that just existed, but I just didn't know what it was. And I exactly use those words that it's not 
a vitamin, it's not a supplement, it's not this, but I knew it was there. And three days later, it actually found me. And it found me exactly like through how I am sharing this video. It was exactly that same way. But what stood out, like for me, is just I knew, I know that when something I'm like, I'm calling it, I just know that if it's if it arrives, I just know that because I've been calling it. But furthermore, why it was a validation? Because it was exactly the same words that I was using, where I was saying, it's much more than this. It's much more than that. And that was exactly the words that were being used. So it would it literally was whatever you want to call it, a manifestation, whatever it is, but I knew it existed and there it was. Whenever I used to try you know, products or, and all definitely like natural. So they come from nature and I used to resource myself from them. I used to always feel that my body is, is adjusting to that external resource that I'm putting in. Like I always felt that there was an alchemy that an alchemy process and I was aware of it. And that's why sometimes it wasn't always, I would feel like I maybe took too much. So then I would lower, although that was like the normal dosage or whatever. But I always used, I was, my body was able to pick up on that. And the reason I see it is because, like I was saying in the beginning, is that we're all made up of codes and frequencies and geometries in that way. So when you're putting that external resource to you, it has its own code. It has its own spirit. It has its own frequency. And what happens is that when it comes into your body, there is an alchemizing process. There is a way where it has to be in some sort of match to your own energy. It has to be in some sort of support. So those codes need to be, or those frequencies need to be in some sort of support to you because then they're alchemizing. And Eventually, what you want it to be is that it's supporting you to be more in unison, more in um, in release and, and openness so that you can get to embody more of those higher states of consciousness within you. Now, as I was saying, for me, I always felt that I always felt that there was an add on. I always felt that I was it was alchemizing. And sometimes not all of them were actually supportive to my frequency. And so I I felt like deep down, I was always calling in for something that was in complete match with my frequency and that is able to open up my body to increase and amplify its own original frequency, its own original blueprint. And so this is exactly what Redox does. Redox is actually beyond even natural. It's actually what your body makes inside of you. And not nothing out there exists that you actually take in. You, whatever you want, you su supplement, you out, you resource yourself from. That is actually what you make originally. So on a coding level, it actually is the closest to your body than any other things that you actually can put in within you. And that is why you, with the moment that you actually take it in, your body recognizes it that it's what you make. So it's, there's no need for alchemy. There's no need for even, you know, if you say like, oh, but this didn't work for me. This has gave me side effects. This, there's none of that because it's native to you. It's native to you. It's what your body makes. And beyond that, it's actually what is inside you on a foundational level. It's cellular. It's, we're talking here, DNA level. So even more, it's going into your core, your core system, your core frequency. And by doing that, it's amplifying your ability to heal yourself. It's amplifying your ability to open up to more light. I feel this is a breakthrough to be able to fill yourself with what you make, what you originally have, and not only what you originally have, but what is actually life itself. Because without redox, nothing can live. It, it just, the moment that you stop making redox, you'll just basically die. Your body will stop functioning. So even more having that 
come into our awareness that what you're taking is life. So when you're having this, um, this, this code being ac- being amplified within you, and having your body support, you're supporting yourself by fueling it with more light, fueling it with more life. It's actually taking your body on a completely different level. It's even taking your entire reality on a different level. Because we know that everything stems out of our own temple, of our own body, because it's like the container, right, of our own consciousness. Like you can't be having um, super light reality and existence and an existence that's very connecting and you feel like you're connected to everything, but yet your body is very dense and it's filled with all those, you know, um, yeah, just all this density and all this these blockages within you, physical, energetic, emotional, and you're not in that in that um, openness, in that open state. It's impossible. It's one of the same. Another thing why redox is so important and is in alignment, because if you're someone that knows that at the end of the day, you are the medicine. You are the one that holds those dormant keys within you that have just been been waiting to activate and reawaken. And just to remember that we, each one of us holds that power. But the thing is, is that we've been, we've been living in this world that is just trying and doing its best in the old matrix to shut us down, to make our body the least functioning, the least connected to spirit, the least connected to light, the least connected to nature. Um, So just having that existence where we're just being bombarded with those things. I feel that this redox has, has come as this really this new earth technology, this technology really from the light that has come to support us in this time, support us Maybe in the past things were very different, but right now support our body even more with this evolution of consciousness to support us to return home. And this remembrance that we are the medicine, you are the medicine. At the end of the day, as much as we get, you know, we get that extra support and we're returning right to that wisdom and intelligence of nature and using those plant medicines and all of that. And um, the, the, yeah, what nature is able to provide us from those medicinal herbs. At the end of the day, we know that the body has its ability to heal itself if it's given the right space and time, but also if it's given the right code. And that is why redox signaling molecule is an uttermost for me alignment with that because it reminds us that we are the medicine. By fueling ourselves with our own inner resonance, by fueling ourselves with our own inner frequency, we're giving our body the time and space to remember, to remember to heal itself. We're giving it its space to reconnect, to reopen, to come back into that balance that it was always meant to have. The other thing also that I've spoken a bit more in depth with my previous video, which I'm going to tag below, where I did a transmission about what Redux does energetically. But when we're talking is that it's actually a cellular cellular technology because those molecules, what they're doing is that they're amplifying the communication uh, between your cells. And we know that all light data and light information is stored within the cells and we know that right that it goes beyond it's literally what quantum quantum existence lives and expresses itself inside the cells we know that that's why there's no past future or present it's all existing within the cell whether it's past life stuff it's ancestral things anything is actually existing within the cells the cells hold that intelligence so imagine now that redox is coming and it's actually amplifying that communication so that the cells are able to better transfer that data that quantum data between each other that light data because at the end of the day This is what information is. It's light information. It's this intelligence. So it's awakening. It's opening your body up to that dormant intelligence that's within you. And you just needed that support. That's like, boom, here we go. Activate. 
Let's unify that intelligence. Let's unify that transference of information, that transference of energy. Another point that I've also spoken about, about as well is actually how it allows you to unify your own field, to unify your physical body, hence to unify also your energetic body, and eventually to unify your creation, your reality, your physical reality, what is on the outside. What it's doing is that it's amplifying your awareness. It's supporting your body to amplify its, the awareness that is within you so that you're able to pick up on misalignments, to pick up on distortions, to pick up on illusions much faster so that then you can align them faster. Because let's, let's look at it this way. So if on a physical level, what it's doing is that it's bridging and amplifying the communication between your cells right? And what is the purpose of that? Is because by amplifying the communication between your cells, which is what we're made of, everything is made up of cells, including your pineal gland, which we're going to talk about a little bit later. But basically, by amplifying that communication, what it's doing is that it's the purpose of the cells is to really go and detect where there is any sort of misalignment, where there's any sort of damage in your body so that they can repair it. Okay, so imagine that now on a, that scale of the physical body, now in the energetic realm, it's doing the same thing. So if you're having something that is where it's able to amplify that energetic communication within you to be able to detect where there's a distortion, where there's an illusion in your field, where there's an energetic block within your field, so that you're able then to release it, repair it, integrate it within yourself. So now actually talking also about the pineal gland and why I know that this supplementing or supporting your body with redox can actually support you also in your in those um, in those um, awakenings that you're having, whether it's your light body awakening, Kundalini awakening, where those spontaneous realities, right, where you're having maybe extreme symptoms or extreme reactions where there's this huge shift or transformation happening in your body. So what this can actually help you do is that can help balance and integrate because it can really bring that whole space into unison. So it can help calibrate that extreme energy that is actually moving through you and help in a way channel it, help in a way contain it. Now, why I'm saying this is because it's supporting your body, your physical body, be in match with that new energy. And the thing is, in those moments when you're having those spontaneous light body activation or Kundalini activation or whatever, or this spiritual awakening process, but on a physical, visceral level, what it's, it's actually too much new energy that's coming in into your denser body. And there can be a little bit of that clash. So when you're having your body support itself with redox, what it's doing is that it's able then to fortify your body's ability, your body's communication system to be like, okay, now we're dealing with this. Let's go and tack let's go and support the body. Let's go and tackle it. So there's this amplification of support, this amplification of communication in your body. And hence again with the pineal gland, because it's just like we said, everything is made of actually cells so the pineal gland is also cells in your body that are releasing so if in any way this like resourcing yourself with redox is also helping open up and balance and activate this your own inner um, connection your own inner antennas to the spirit world and your own inner antennas that allow you to open up to consciousness itself My last point is, which I love and is going to be, yeah, the biggest point I would say from all of this is that just like in my energy work, we we tackle and, and focus on the root cause because we know that the root cause is where everything sits, is where literally you're going and you're changing the pattern at its corest of the corest of the corest of everything. And the moment that you change the pattern there, it's like a ripple then it ripples out and is able through all different dimensions and layers of yourself and your field is able to start feeling the transformation and the change. So that's what actually I do in my energy work. We go to the root cause on the energetic field and rewrite, reprogram the pattern.
pattern of whatever that shadow was, that wounding, that program or whatever that uh, issue was or whatever that block was. So now coming in and doing the exact same thing on a physical level, because that is what is unique about Redox and different, is that it's not only tackling, first of all, it's not only tackling one thing in your body, it's tackling the foundation, which is sedator, which is everything in your body. So it's not only tackling one specific pathway or one specific organ or one specific thing, it's tackling all of you, which is amazing because it's the same also with energy work is that we look into your entire system. And then from there, we start going in and in and in and in into deeper and deeper layers. But on top of that, what it's actually doing, it's not focusing on fixing the symptom. It's not focusing on fixing just that top layer of where the issue is. It's actually going to the root. So Rita comes and is working on the root of where that malfunction or that block or that de or that or that, yeah, that problem is in your physical body, so then it can actually repair it. So for me, this is the perfect alignment, the perfect synergy, and the perfect support along with energy work, along with energy work, along with integration, to have something that is doing the same thing, but in your physical body. So I'm really excited to have shared that with you. If you felt the resonance in anything that I've shared, you felt the frequency of redox, the importance of it, please try it out for yourself. The website is in the description below. They're actually operating in 35 countries. So if you're in any of those countries, you can go there, pick your market, and it will be delivered to your home. But also, I'm actually calling in for other light workers, other conscious leaders that are feeling the frequency of this. They're understanding the importance of it to actually join the team of light and to integrate that in their business. So if you would like that as well, please don't forget to email me. But either way, if you have any other questions regarding Redox, you can email me. I've also um, connected in the description below other videos that I've done if you're curious to learn more about the energetics of this technology. But also I've shared the my own personal experience from benefiting from this technology on a physical level and also that of my stepson that is on the spectrum. It was literally life-changing. So check those out as well. And please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Much love.